It's up. It's up. It's literally on him. You have. He wouldn't lie about that. Exactly. Game one starting off on PS2. I am master just starting out by jumping into a can taking court. That poor policeman. <laughs> he got down here by Mario and just took that world of hurt for no reason. I am Nintendo breaking out of the up air combo with a bot or with a can rather, but Master keeping the pressure on. Oh, I love that hand going into the up air. It's so cool seeing when Duck Hunt is trying to set up his camp and it all just works out. You just make such creative and colorful combos. Back throw. Outside jump over fireball. He's going to be able to let Mario get in so well. It's so difficult to deal with. Again, that F smash coming in. We've been seeing, we've been seeing Nintendo do that a lot. He'll just kind of run back and as a whip punish do that F smash because it is one of those F smashes where he kind of leans back and it's just able to whip punish so many times. Yeah, it's really good doing that. The heart box shifting on it. Honestly, one of the most notable ones in this game. I feel that back air almost killing Mass Mario. But Mass Mario good on the DI. I like that. That was so clean. What was all that? Putting the can down. I will. I probably would have SD too. That scared the crap out of me. I expected the can to like fly at him and then all of a sudden it was just stuck there and there was nowhere Master could really go. Now Master opening up with another combo. Another triple up air coming in. Master Mario just gonna uh, accept the damage, not trying to go for anything cheeky. Right, cross up for Master. He likes to do that so many times. He'll cross up your shield, spot dodge, and usually do a smash attack or a grab. Alright, these fireballs are going to prove difficult, but great air hard up. I forgot that can do that in this game. Nintendo kind of throwing out some smash attacks. That's kind of one of the characteristics you see from Nintendo a lot. And up smashing right through the clay pigeon. Yeah, spot dodge cancel on that smash ultimate, baby. The ultimate combo. Speaking of ultimate combos, triple frisbee coming in. Oh, he looked for a fourth. Yeah, sometimes you just got to accept the damage and flew a little too close to the sun on that one. Alright, Master doing a good job of just recognizing the traps Nintendo setting up and making it be so it though. Back with what a conversion. That frisbee just it's always there for you. Now we have one sock apiece going uh, off a little too uh a little too preemptive. I would have been really funny. Master tried to go down there and do an edge guard, but he just wanted to see what he was gonna do. Alright, up throw, gets two uppers, looks for a third, but doesn't fire Nintendo able to land. Oh, I like the Bass Mario running away. Knew that Nintendo was going to want to do a grab. Again, Bass is, he's just grab, he's jumping over whenever Nintendo's wanting to grab. He kind of knows the way that Nintendo wants to play. This is still even as even can be. Nintendo really does maybe need one or two more Frisbee conversions to take this back. Alright, there's one. Looks for another one on the platform, but... An up smash from Master Mario gonna cover it. That was the one time I really expected Nintendo to do an up smash. I think it would have hit on yeah, both I sides. Do. I felt that up smash coming from Nintendo, but he didn't commit to it. There's one thing that both these players are gonna do. It is up smash. Getting into game two now. So getting into game two, we're going to be on town and city. I like this stage. A lot of room for Duck Hunt to set up his camp, get a lot of damage in. And at the same time, you notice that Master Mario is killing a lot off the top. Town and city, much bigger blast zone, so these up smashers are not going to kill quite as early. God oh. damn! It looked like Nintendo tried to return the favor with a spike of his own as a little get off me tool, but Master Mario outspacing it, throws out his own forward air and going to get the stop from way up top. That was... That was a great, uh, great start to game two here for Masta. Yeah, I mean, if you're a Master Mario fan, that's what you really want to see here. That's what you live for. Back airing through the Frisbee, but the Frisbee a little too thick. Nintendo throwing out another one of these death matches. Maybe getting a little desperate for the kill. This is quite a deficit to go off. Only 40 seconds in the match. He's already lost two stocks have already been gone. 
Yeah, and that was a great read. He saw all the pressure he was putting on Master and said, I know you're going to try and roll in and gather. What kind of scoop was that, though? Uh, kind of blessed with some uh, wonky hitboxes in this game. Big F smash coming in, but not killing Duck Hunt just yet. Perfect roll behind Duck Hunt to get that punish. I mean, I feel like we've seen that roll work out for both players. That's how he lost his last stock with Nintendo read the roll, but we're also seeing Master get such big punishes off the roll, it's not surprising to see him still go for it. Now Master is turning up with his damage, and the platform coming almost in time. Alright, good air dodge there from Nintendo Games, so back to the ledge. Master just kind of respecting Nintendo's face and just running away. I don't want to deal with that. Right. Oh, great can right there. That was such a scary spot for Nintendo. Yeah, but that fireball actually just sending the can back. I love how Master Mario is kind of bobbing and weaving through these Nintendo's projectiles. It just kind of goes to show that this is uh, this is not a source rodeo. Nintendo even covering that spot dodge, knowing exactly where Master Mario is going to want to go. And he actually had that roll, but he was just a little too early. And then up smash out shield, going to be able to punish Nintendo's up smash. Yeah, Perry thought he had time, but uh, that's the one thing about Duck Hunt is that all the smash attacks have a bit of startup, so against Mario, who has, you know, negative frame data, or his moves are negatively possible to punish. It's going to be a little difficult. So Master now up. 2-0 against Nintendo. Let's see how Nintendo's gonna answer. We've seen him pull out some tricks. Those will be the ultimate, uh, this will be the ultimate trick to be able to reverse the realm. Alright, so getting back into on town and say once again, just, you know, maybe Nintendo's saying, I can't count myself out. You know, I got a really unlucky start of game two where Master Mario was just on top of him, killed him super early. If he can avoid that, maybe this game will be a bit closer. On the other hand, though, it looks like Master's really starting to figure out uh, Nintendo's defensive pressure. But... Yeah, that looks like a really good start to the uh, start opener for Nintendo. Yeah, Nintendo just all over. Master says, I can mix it up still, you know? Like, Master thought he figured out, like, when to roll, when to, like, spot dodge, things like that. And Nintendo's been all over it. Good stuff from Master Mario, kind of running away from that down smash. That was most definitely would have scooped. Yeah. Yeah. And the back are almost taking it against Nintendo. So scary to be above Mario, especially with that down there. That would have taken the stock. There's some things that like it's weird that you're like, oh, I'm above him, so I'm scared of his down air killing me off the top. He's dead. Oh my it's god, not. that duck is that dog is broken. That duck has been putting in work at the gym, man. That duck has a gain. I definitely thought he was dead because he didn't have an air dodge. Ah, oh, there we go. That he down air. Killing him. Yeah, he went up with a down air to kill him and technically he got it. There we go, there's a damage in classic Mario. The classic Master Mario setup where he gets that fry bar into the nair, into the uh grab. So much damage. Yeah, it's real good stuff there. Very last hit of that first week. Gonna cast Nintendo out of some damage. Nintendo having a bit of a lead here, but this is still really even. Great air dodge. You don't want to be on on the top platform against Mario. Okay, so that double first the upper is gonna wow, barely that take killed it. Him. I didn't think it was gonna kill him because of town, but maybe the DI wasn't too great. Or maybe Nintendo's just a legend. I'm gonna believe that. Yeah, honestly. Really good from Master Mario. That's such a good trade too. When the fireball uh, goes through the clay pigeon, it kind of cancels out the little bit of lag that Duck Hunt has. He's able to just kind of act out sooner. Looks like Nintendo is looking good for this game three. A down smash, almost killing Nintendo, but not quite yet. 
back air on the neutral gonna, gonna take it. Mas uh, Mario able to do two back airs in one short hop, so you gotta be worried about that. Yeah, Mario, that's crazy that Mario has that. Yeah, the Nintendo 113 unanswered percent. Yeah, very ambitious with that jump, or with the up smash. I know Master was jumping in, but it was really unlikely he was just gonna jump into that. Either way, though, no, okay. Oh, he even tried to put the can out. Now this is scary, 60%, and so much damage came in quick. I like how he upgraded that can, and he didn't even press it at all, because you just don't know where that was going to go. All right, Master has to dig deep to bring this one back. Nintendo looking great on this game number three. Dash attack. And he's putting in that damage, but exploding, killing barely going to kill him. Master's looking at the looking at the camera right now. I know it's on purpose, but I see you. It's one of those uh, office cuts, real quick. Just really. Ah, uh, yeah. <laughs> I see. I did not see the stage choice for this next game. It looks like Nintendo kind of kind of getting on to where to what Nintendo wanted to do and what Master Mario wanted to do. That game was looking a lot better than that first two. Master kind of had all the stops. He was dictating the pace of the match. That game a lot better for him. Forward throw into the dash tag. Good bit of damage here. I'm really curious what causes the clay pigeon to break. Because we saw earlier, like, Leon's uppy wasn't breaking it. Master's fireballs aren't breaking it. But I know that it can be broken, you know? I guess it's knockback dependent. If I had a guess. Maybe. My back throws him right into the can. And a clean first stock from Nintendo again. Only 14%. Yeah, I mean, I feel like Master chose this stage to make it so Nintendo can't run away set up space. But I feel like this would just be very good for Nintendo because there's nowhere for Master to retreat and kind of collect himself, figure out where to go. There we go, Master finally getting a conversion of his own, but missing that up till. Tries to F smash that two frame, but I can hit again. Another flash attack. Nero just going through the can. Now this is where it's dangerous for Nintendo. He doesn't have can available to him. Oh, I love that parry on that last of that smash. Yeah, that was confidence right there. Nasa looking a little desperate for this kill now. And that F smash going to now bring him down 3-1. to one. Nintendo looking like he has the download. Yeah, all of a sudden, Nintendo's really just started running away with these games. But back here is going to take Nintendo's first stock 2-1 to one here. On triple up air, getting some damage in. Trying to get this read with the Frisbee. That was so difficult to... That was such a bad position to be in. You had the can on one side, and you had all of Duck Hunt on the other. Yeah, it's very reminiscent of, like, when you're between Rob and his gyro. Mm -hmm. Uncomfortable position to be in, but Nintendo says, I don't care about Rob or any other character. I'm going to make it work right now. My Duck Hunt is on point. And the Master going off that bear, showing a little desperation, wanting that kill. And I would, too. I don't want to take this back to a game five, the risk of being reverse 3-0. Yeah, and Duck Hunt, again, he's one of those characters where he's got so many projectiles, makes it so difficult to just play the game. It can be frustrating, you know? It, it's got to be a bit of mental damage here on Master as well. And again, that down smash is going to take it. Nintendo bringing it to a game five. Yeah, two star. <laughs> yeah. So now Nintendo bringing it over to a game five. About to reverse 3 0 him. Massa not looking too happy about that. Let's see, we're going to be going for game five. Massa needs to figure out what stage. He needs to make the proper adjustments. I want that game one and two, Massa, where you just had to download. Yeah. Told Nintendo what are we going to do, and then he did I'm it. I'm not running back to Smash Roller from Massa. It did not work out for him. Instead, it's going to be Tan Say. He says, small stage didn't work out. Let's go a big one, see, see how this goes again. Mm -hmm. I mean, he did win the first game on town. They didn't win the second one, but it's going to be important for him to win the third one. Mm -hmm. Here we are, the last game of winner's finals. I mean, semis. Yeah, Nintendo really looking at Punch's ticket to lose semis here. Not if Master has anything to say about it. Back to the default Mario. Oh, that really bad air dodge from Master Mario. Able to just go back into the mix of the can into the duck hunt. Yeah, 
Nintendo's been using his projectiles so well instead of the long period pressure, but it's not just that that's doing it. He's, his movement's been impeccable, dashing in and out whenever he gets a hit in front of his can to really mix up with a master with I go. go. Oh my gosh, it didn't. Oh, we thank God for town. Long he was. We thank God for town. That was a perfect DI for Master Mario. He does not want to lose any of these stocks earlier than he has to, if at all. There we go. Nintendo throwing out these mass attacks. That back air still not going to kill. I can see why Master maybe wanted to go to town. Yeah, I out of hell chill too. I don't care. Do whatever I, I you want know to, what me. to do. If you ran I up had no clue what to do there. If you ran up and grabbed me, you earned that, but I'm not dropping this shield. And up smash not gonna do it either. Nothing Town, is killing. Town showing its colors here. Yeah, Master rolling back again. Nintendo maybe catching on to how he well, that he's gonna do that. I like that Nintendo is kind of running away, going for these whip punishes, and that's really has been getting a lot of these docks and a lot of these uh, a lot of this damage. Yeah, and I feel like we're seeing Master kind of take a mental reset on this game, playing it very slowly and patiently, unlike the last couple of ones we've seen from him. Oh, perfect shield from Master, who's so close to getting hit by that can, which might have killed. Yeah, and I like that can placement from Nintendo, putting it at roll distance before he grabbed the lead, so he was able to roll onto it basically for free, because Master couldn't be in a position to cover it without getting hit. Um, finally, that can going to take out both uh, players' stocks so far. Yeah, and this game's been incredibly even. Yo, get that officer out of here. What took him so long? All right, up front to the nair, or uh, down or rather, Master has a lead, but Nintendo immediately answering back. And again, like I said, that fireball kind of clinking with the clay, clay pigeon and duck hunt, able to give him a little more time to get whatever punish he needs. Is there one of those Nintendo making duck hunt look godlike videos yet? Because I feel like that's about to be. I mean, they're pro. I mean, all the times he got like his wins were like mm. Evo, and so I think now it's gonna start happening. Yeah, I feel like we're gonna see that one soon. And as I said, that master finally taking that second stock, hitting a lead. And if I'm master, I want to keep up this lead as much as possible. Here we go. Here's the okay, damage. That's big, and it's all true. Nintendo can't get the can out. This is start where it's trying to look scary. Master with the momentum. Nintendo hasn't been able to set up his wall. And here we go. Master momentum coming in. He is playing hot. Right there. there. Not gonna kill. I'm loving this counter pick from Master Mario. It's working out. It's paying out dividends for him. Back throw, sending the dog away. Master's looking so good right now, but I'm not counting out Nintendo. F tilt going over the can. Yeah, that was just character knowledge right there, through and through. Uh, he's got out that roll with a back air. This is looking rough for Vinny. Oh, that's it. He got the side B instead of the up B. That's so unfortunate. One more clay pigeon for the fans out 